out of Michigan. I mean, I think, I think right now Nick will be keep doing this until he until the wheels fall off. I, I think so. Yeah. So it's always fun to you know I follow, you know I chat with him on Twitter. Kendra. It's always fun to see where he's ending up going when he's going back to Japan when he's coming here. Like oh, uh, when I talked with him uh, Thursday night, he didn't know where he was going to be next week. Wow, that's the life. Wow. Hulk took a lot of damage there with a missed push but block, he got but the hit. comes back in. Yeah. So this is now exactly where Kane wants to be to take out Zero. The other two characters, he's told me, he has no no worries about. Yep. Only a few Virgils he's worried about. It's worth noting that, and it makes sense given the character, Hulk is the only character in the game that has 30% minimum damage scaling. Couple of, a lot of the top tier have 20, and some other characters do, but he's the only one with 30. So when you're doing the, like, I don't know if they knew that he could do these combos. When yeah, they, you I'm know, sure so, they did not, yeah. So he just hits like a Mack truck, which he's supposed to. He's the Hulk. I'd expect nothing less. Oh. X-Factor there, okay. He's going to go for the kill. It's the intention. Yeah, I mean, it was either pop back factor or level four, and I think this was probably the better call. Well, it's really looking like a good call so far. Yeah. Sentinel now comes in. Okay. All the way back, JDM. And see, I find this amusing because when we were talking about character bans, I banned Virgil because yeah. I said, I don't want to lose to that. Right, right. I don't care what I lose to as long as it's not that. Well, I think I think Kane is more worried about point play. Right. If, if he if he gets a kill on a character, he thinks he should just win the game. And he's right. I mean, he, the game is largely about momentum. Oh. Happy birthday, though, for JDM speaking of momentum. Right. Sense it all gone. Now we have seen Kane make comebacks with Hagar. Oh, absolutely. It's not easy at all, especially against a team like this. Well, not only that, but it's going to be even harder because now you, we can hear the crowd. Uh, you know, the court members always cheer each other on and get pretty loud. And so now that JDM's looking like he might go 2-0, they're going to get rowdy and he needs to be able to stay, maintain his composure. Slow approach for Hagar. He got him cornered, but is Zero going to be able to run away? No, he just pushes him back. So much Look push at that. Back. Yeah. And he gets underneath as soon oh. as there was a super jump. He took but the He didn't even need to. He had him full screen just from the projectile. Got to get X-Factor going. He does. Yeah. Well. JDM, JDM is having none of that. Trying to keep a Zero in top eight. Good blocks. Hulk just top blocking. Oh! Wow, I was wondering what he was trying to do there. Looked like I'm a frame trap almost. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you can really hear the corn guys in the background yeah, at the moment. They get real. They get real. You, you can buy that with KI. Right, KI is getting loud. We're at UFGT 10. That's Come on, right. let's go. Finals day. Again, slow approach for Hagar. Well, not only that, but drones really don't help him because he can counter call that really easily. Oh, <laughs> even that. What? Okay. Okay, goes over to Sentinel. Great block. Now we'll see whether the robot can do anything better. JDM's about to get another bar. There it is. Zero's just too short. And he punishes him for it too, which is hard to do. Hard tag over to Hagar. Now Hagar's job, it'd be great if he got the kill, but I, I would want him to just wait it out. Let Sentinel get some red life back. No. Not much. Got an X Factor. Oh, oh, no. He didn't think it was going to hit. Everything could go. Oh, he gets another? Another chance. Another chance. 
Kane now it's in the corner. Up to Mr. The mix ups. Oh, oh, he was looking for air throw. Scoop. He was looking for air throw. It didn't come. JD Aim stayed on the ground. That's the. KBR. Quite a, quite a pop off as yeah. JDM got off, you can see. And you can still hear his teammates in the background. I mean, quick set over KB KBR to eliminate him. Yeah. There's something to be said about that energy, that adrenaline rush. It helps. It's, it's like nothing in the world. It helps. You know? For a lot of people, it helps. Kane, I think at this point, is used to dealing with people cheering for and against him. Yeah. It's happened a lot on both sides. That's true. I don't think that that affected him. I just think that was great play by JDM. Like, so one side of loser.